Odell Bazell has been electrifying stages, lecture halls, and auditorium. Odell Bazell is a trained facilitator by Toastmasters International, a successful entrepreneur, an author, and he's still in his 20s. He's been featured in USA Today, Yahoo Finance, CNBC.com, and over 200 media outlets. I'm Michael Marsh from Indian River State College, and I just got done listening to Odell's Next Level, and he ripped it. He was inspirational, motivational, and you need to bring him to your campus. He was a standout among all presenters at our national conference. He helped me to understand that I need to continue to build family among my students, and he also told me that there is hope in no matter what I do, and I should share that with all of my students. So the purpose of the thing is unknown. Abuse is inevitable. It's your purpose. Your purpose, your purpose in life is to give the world a glimpse of heaven by what you do, what you have, and who you are. That's your purpose. See, it doesn't matter if you're spiritual or not. You think of all the good things that could possibly be in one place when you think of heaven. And it's your job, we're all sitting here with the mission inscribed in our DNA to give the world a glimpse of that from which we come. That's a purpose. You should have this young man come and speak at your school. You will really enjoy it. Hi, my name is Robin Reed and I am the Vice President of Public, uh, Public Relations with our Phi Theta Kappa chapter here at Texas State Technical College. We had Odell Zell come out, he was our speaker. He did an awesome job. Everybody say impact. 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 Everybody say change. Change. Say impact. Impact. Everybody say change. change. All right, because I'm short and black, I'm Gary Coleman, right? So he's trying to play. So then I got, I got angry. I was like, oh, he's not trying to play. He's trying to run the so I turned him back around. Pointed his face and said, well, at least I'm not an all-American jerk that came with a bowl game. And then it kind of went quiet after that. <laughs> then he, had, he had stood up. <laughs> he, 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 was, he was 6'6", 220. I'm 5'8", 175 after Thanksgiving. So, he said, perfected passion produces prosperity. Three components of success. The first one is passion. Everybody say passion. Everybody say purpose. And the last step is profit. Everybody say profit. So you've got when all these three things coalesce, then you have success. Now passion, I wrote a book a couple years ago called Perfected Passion Produces Prosperity. And your passion is that thing. It's that thing, Malcolm. It's that thing that you would do it every day. Every day, all day, every day. And then go sleep, wake up, and want to do it again. Hi, my name is Melvin Harrison. I'm the Assistant Director of Student Activities here at Nichols State University in Thibodeau, Louisiana. Just wanted to inform you that Mr. Odell Bazell is an awesome presenter. It was great. I encourage you to get him and book him and use him to help your students grow and develop as great leaders. Hi, I'm Lisa Listash. I am the Supervisor of Student Activities at Texas State Technical College, Waco Campus. We have been so thrilled to have Odell Bazell here with us today, and he was outstanding. The, the students loved him, the faculty loved him, our administration loved him, and I certainly do recommend that you take the opportunity to invite him to your campus as soon as possible. Siri, this is like some Facebook posting, tweet, Flickr, Instagram, and infographic, serious stuff. Looking at your weaknesses, yeah, your weaknesses are your weaknesses, but they're only your weaknesses because you're stronger somewhere else. They're only your weaknesses because you're stronger somewhere else. It's always a battle between evil and good. It's always a battle between health and sickness. It's always a battle. It's always a battle. And so you have to look at your threats. What's going to stop you from getting where you need to be? What's going to stop you? Because, I mean, I'm a pretty good speaker, right? If you don't know where you're going, any road will take you there. One is too small, a number for greatness. 
You don't even have to ask if I'll invite him back because I will.